Okay, so I'm out here today working on my 1963 MTD lawn flight. I've gone ahead and replaced all of the ignition components. I've put everything back together. Now we're gonna see, will it start? So to start off, I'm just gonna choke it a bit and give it some throttle. And we'll see if it'll start all on its own. It's got a wire hooked up to the choke temporarily. I'm gonna put some gloves on so I don't put my hands on the pull start. And maybe we can even drive this thing today. Turn the gas on. Was interesting the clutch is not working put it in gear and it just takes off <laughs> but it's running okay so I've spent some time just swapping the, the pulley and the belt underneath so hopefully that'll make it a little easier to put in gear without it taking off just as a side note this mower never had a brake on it so I plan to put one on it I've put a little go-kart style drum brake on the sprocket there so at least now it has the provisions to have a brake but originally it never did so that's that's how I ran it before so it, it should be should be doable but let's see I'd like to get it fired up take it out and if it's uh, if it is drivable I would like to also try out the mower deck so let's see
So I didn't get a whole lot of footage, but there you go. It is running, driving, and mowing. And I took it out back, got it stuck in the leaves and the mud. Uh, the uh, throttle and the governor aren't quite right. It started to run, run a bit too fast, and I had the throttle all the way down. Uh, the governor's, it's not even right. So, you know, it needs some work, needs some tinkering, but like, it's, it's there, it's done. It's, it's running and driving and mowing. So can't beat that. I'll shut that gas off before I forget. So this thing's been on the back burner of mine since I was like 10, 13, something like that. I got it when I was a kid and it was a basket case then and well, it's a little bit of a better basket case now. It's pretty cool. I got the old old school air cleaner on it. Managed to find all original-ish parts to make it look fairly original. Anyways, uh, I'm stoked about that. The, the little transmission has an issue. It had the same issue before where it likes to pop out of gear so you kind of got to hold it in gear as you're going that's also why I kind of had to put the camera down but hey that's that's not too bad it's all there and it's it is working so I'm not going to complain too much it can just become part of my collection and I can bring it out every now and then and mow with it for, just for fun because why not the perfect size for a small city lot so I'll use it <laughs> so I might touch up the paint on it a little bit better because like all this was from you know 20 years ago Ooh, that exhaust is hot I can never get reproduction decals for it uh, but like I've repainted the deck and stuff the rest of it could I, I was trying to keep it sort of patinaed, kind of rat rodish, but maybe I'll just go ahead and touch up the rest of the paint. And I do have a, a new MTD decal that could go right there, but then I don't have all these stripes. And maybe I'll put a brake on it too, but it's running pretty good right now. It drives okay without the brake, as long as you, as long as you're careful. Well, there we go. As always, thanks for watching, and until next time, I'll see you then.